2004 Finals MVP Chauncey Billups and the Pistons host three-time Finals MVP Tim Duncan in the Spurs at the Palace of Auburn Hills. Tony Parker takes it all the way for the short runner in the lane in the first period. He would score all eight of the Spurs' first quarter points. Off the Spurs' miss, Carlos Arroyo throws the long outlet pass. Ahead to Tayshawn Prince for the easy layup at the end of one. Pistons up 18-8. to eight. Ben Wallace in the second quarter drives down the lane and kicks it to Rip Hamilton for the corner three ball. It caps a 19-2 Pistons run. Detroit's up 21-8. Tony Parker feeds Tim Duncan, who blows past Rasheed Wallace for the dunk. And now Detroit's lead is down to four points. Chauncey Billups drives. Parker's not there, and the layup goes down. Billups with a game high 20 points at halftime. Pistons up 40-30. to 30. It's the lowest scoring first half for the Spurs all season. Spurs cut the lead to four with a nice pass inside to Tim Duncan for the flush. Then Detroit struggles to hit the shots in the third quarter, but Ben Wallace keeps it alive, and Mo Evans gets it back for the lay-in. Pistons out-rebound the Spurs by 27 in the game. Spurs go back to Tim Duncan, who muscles in for the turnaround fadeaway. Jay Duncan, 18 points, 11 rebounds for another double-double in the fourth quarter. On the blocks, Antonio McDice kicks it out to Rasheed Wallace for the three ball. Detroit's lead is up to 66-57. More from the Pistons. Chauncey Billups misses the layup, but Big Ben Wallace follows with a putback slam. He would have seven offensive rebounds, 21 for the game. It's a happy day and a Merry Christmas for the fans at the Palace of Auburn Hills as the Pistons win 85-70. to They dominate the boards, pulling down 57 rebounds to 30 for San Antonio, 18-6 to on the offensive end.